by saying to them, I see you're sad today, I think personally, you're validating that person and, and you know, you're hearing where they're at. They're not saying I'm sad or they're not saying what's going on, but you can see it in their demeanor. And when you acknowledge that, that feeling um, or that emotion, um, I think you're connecting on that heart. And I think as a human being, whoever we are, if somebody feels heard, not just listened to, but heard, I think it validates the person. I think it's an immediate connection. Somebody has heard me, you know, whether I'm happy or sad. And equally, not just I see you're sad, I see this is a really happy day for you. I see you're really in, you know, this is, this is, you know. I've heard of so many people who um, take their loved ones to a beach and then they're disappointed because the loved one isn't all kind of, you know, and they do kind of sometimes these grandiose things um, and the person doesn't react and they get very upset. But you know, it's about that one minute, person to person. I have seen many, many and heard many people talk about, you know, bringing the person, you know, or creating a reaction where there is no reaction, where the body is all but nearly paralyzed, where you will get a reaction because of something that really means something. You know, it's like Sean Donnell and bringing in, you know, the little baby and sitting it on his mom's knees and getting this smile where there hasn't been a smile in two and three years. So that to me isn't coming from the brain. I don't think anyway, it's not coming from the brain. It's, it's coming from that heart place where there that is still that connection. So, you know, I've heard somebody quite harshly say, you know, oh, what's the bother in t spending time with my father? You know, he, there's, there's uh, nearly like there's no c feedback or I'm not getting anything out of it. But we've never had anybody yield of Alzheimer's or dementia, so we don't know. And for me, it would be, well, I'll err on the side of, I believe there is, you know, while there's life, that heart is there and so I would, I would talk and speak to it. There's, there's proof of people who are, you know, again, bedridden and, and a dog is brought into the bed and they can stroke the dog where they, that hand hasn't moved before. So um, I just think while the person is alive, let's give them every hope and dignity.